All right, the best way to find any rattle, squeak, or buzz is to do what I call the tapping test or the tap test. Tap gently in the area or areas that you suspect the noise to be originating from. These screws definitely have kind of a clacking sound. That one and that one. Hear that? These have more of a thud. I'll take my handy Phillips head screwdriver and uh, gently tighten all of the screws to this astro ventilation vent. Be careful, of course, to not over tighten or strip the threads and since when you tighten on one side it might affect the other side might raise it up to be sure to tighten all of them okay sounds better yeah more of a thud instead of a clack now just go back and make sure they're all snug and tight See that one's a, okay. That's a little better. Now they should all sound pretty good. Yeah. Now they've got a good thud instead of clacking. So they should be tight. We'll go around the other side and tighten the other grill also. Okay. Just uh. This, this side's a, a little better, but it never hurts to, uh, while we're doing this, to just tighten them all up. Careful not to over tighten. Don't strip the threads and the screws. And that should be that. Pretty simple fix. I don't anticipate needing any kind of uh, Loctite or rubber or washers. All right. Now I'll have to take it out and road test it. Happy 4th of July. So I'm out driving my 1973 Stingray. Idling nicely. realize how quiet it is in here for a car built in 1973 you'd expect a lot more squeaks rattles and noises but I have finally cured all of the sounds all I hear Sound of the engine. 